So I don't know about you, but I'm so hyped about this project. Get to design a Charlotte Hornets jersey. Like, where is my life? Who am I? What am I doing? Damn, I'm so proud of myself, man. This is so cool. Hey, it is your boy Junior, and I am back at it with another project. This time around, I'm gonna be doing something way different, something I've never done before. I'm gonna be customizing a jersey for the Charlotte Hornets. That is right, the Charlotte Hornets. Before we get started, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you know LaMelo or anyone in the Charlotte Hornets team, when you guys see this jersey, reach out to your boy. Cause like, I've been waiting for my opportunity and I think this may be it. Who knows, we'll see. Hey guys, so I just got this really cool project working with the Charlotte Hornets. I am about to design one of their jerseys and I'm crazy excited for this. This is actually a really cool gig. To work on their jerseys and to work on some cool design, I've never done this before. I've been researching so much and this is my opportunity to shine. So why not show them? Here we go. and back awesome. unnamed unmarked it's nice. all yours nice. feel free to do whatever and then they'll be displayed on a mannequin That'd and after fun. the game you get it back really yeah damn these are official i know right but i i'm, I'm excited about this this is so new you know what i mean yeah it's very different so i can't we'll wait see, we'll see. Yo, hey, heck so, yeah. nah, cool. so i don't know about you but i'm so hyped about this project get to design a charlotte corners jersey like where is my life who am i what am I doing? Damn, I'm so proud of myself, man. This is so cool. Brand new project. Get to do something new and different, something fun and exciting. We'll see where this goes. So I don't have anything to place the jersey on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the jersey and place this on top of a wooden board that I'm gonna cut. So I found a piece of wood that I found in my shed and I am going to cut it to size so that I can have something to paint against because if I don't, then the paint is gonna go through the jersey and I don't want that because we don't wanna make a mess in this big project. And we, we wanna make sure that we're doing some good things, doing a good job, so watch me work. So because we're in the basketball spirit and we are working with the Charlotte Hornets, I am going to be playing some basketball here in my studio space. If you know me, you know how much I love basketball. I know this is a soccer ball, but if you hate on soccer, I feel sorry for you, but I play with a soccer ball. Oh, sh dang. Gotta make sure the jersey's good, because then, this is all for nothing. So first step is done. I primed it. It was hard priming this. I've never painted a jersey. So painting on this material and having it stick to the wood behind it and what I created was a little like, you know, trying to get around that, but I think we're good. And now we're gonna start mixing our paints to get some color on this bad boy. So let's get this started.
like this with this camera right here to get the perfect shot. The things we do for you guys. I'm joking, the things you do for us. You watch our videos. So now that the front is complete, we're gonna move on to the back. Stay tuned if you wanna watch how this turns out. So I'm not sure if you can tell, but this is my first jersey I ever painted. So I had to do a little bit of research to try to figure out how I was gonna get the paint on this. Luckily enough, I found someone on Instagram who kills it when painting jerseys. He does football jerseys, basketball jerseys, all types of jerseys. And he actually paints the players on the jersey. So his blending and his like technique is just like spot on. So I actually messaged him and I asked him, how does he go about doing it? And he replied to me. I'm just happy that he replied to me because this guy is like really up there, you know? And if you're out there, you watch this video. Thank you so much. Who knows what can come out of this? I learned a new skill, but you know, you never know. So that's why I love trying new things because you just learn so much. That is a wrap. Thank you so much for watching. Shout out to Charlotte is Creative and the Charlotte Hornets for this opportunity. And if you haven't yet, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I am on my way up. I know I'm growing my channel and I want you to come along with me because we are just gonna get on this upward trajectory to touch the sky.